Okay, what's up everybody? This is the Game Virus, also known as the G -G 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 Virus, and we are back with more Let's Play Sound Hill 2 Blind. On the last episode, we finally got out of the hospital, but at a great cost, we lost Maria. Maria got hammered and killed out by the uh, Pyramid Head guy who just appeared behind us down a long-ass hallway that seemed like it would never end. And she got hooking out. We assume this place is batshit insane. I don't trust Maria. I never trusted Maria. I don't even think she's really al alive. I think she's a ghost person or something like that. She might even be the main antagonist of the game in disguise. So we weren't all that choked up about her, seeing as also she's annoying when she's tagging along with us. She doesn't help, and she can get killed and she's somebody I have to worry about, and I don't like that. It's like a big, stupid escort mission. So, we weren't that choked up. James, on the other hand, was very upset. Reminded him of his wife and how he couldn't protect her, Mary. And now he couldn't protect Marina. Now he's giving a shit about that stupid girl, Laura, that we don't care about because she's annoying. And we don't like kids in the first place. There's a memo lying on the sofa. I'll wait at Bar Neely's. Great. More cryptic shit for us to decipher. And oof. It was before I left. What? Oh. I was like, what? I can't leave. <laughs> uh, it's the other door. Before I went in there, there was a health kit on the ground that I didn't I didn't grab. Let me go ahead and grab that real quick. Because, you know, I needed. I used a health kit before I saved from the last I left you guys. Because little did I know I was in danger off of that one swipe from the enemy. I guess I took damage elsewhere. But, uh, man, I did collect a lot of ammunition and, and health and items on the way, so... I'm definitely appreciative of that. I'm still gonna watch my ammo and try to conserve it now that I know how to kill enemies a bit quicker when it comes to melee. If I had known that from the start, I'd be sitting on a lot of... A lot of... A lot of health and ammo. Whoa, where the fuck am I? Where the hell did this take me? I don't think I've ever been here this area or have I it's all marked off like I've ran through this place before but Lord knows I don't remember shit all right well Neely's bar is the closest thing that's new on the checklist of the jobs to do you know before we were just gonna get the letter oh shit before we were just gonna get the letter and the wrench so creepy the way they just stand still like that. But now that we picked up that little thing talking about Neely's bar, I guess that's where we're going now. And as long as they keep giving us health packs, we're gonna be in good shape. As long as they keep giving us all these, oh, they're giving us rifle rounds. Maybe that was what I missed out in the hospital by not going and trying to solve that, that, that game show thing. Where is he? Fuck it. Oh, we can't go in here, huh? That's Happy Burger or something. Well, where's Neely's Bar? Oh, we're not even over there. We're at Happy Burger. Neely's Bar is across the damn street. I wonder what Siri would say if this was, like, a game that took place in, like, uh, nowadays and James had an iPhone. You know? I wonder if it probably wouldn't even work. Siri, I already know what this game would do. It would probably make Siri or any navigational thing just talk to you crazy and shit like that. It should probably just be saying weird crazy shit that doesn't make any sense. Your phone would be like haunted somehow. Probably just wouldn't have any service period actually. This is fucking Silent Hill after all. Oh my god. I'm right at Neely's bar. So let me turn around and hook right. Right past the mannequin creature thing that didn't even react to my presence, which is kind of creepy in itself on its own. Shit, I still can't get into anything. Finally. Oh. Yeah, I'm, I'm really getting a big flashback to Silent Hill 1, just the way shit is. Just wandering around the streets and shit. There was a hole here. It's gone now. Well, that's good. Oh, look at that. Somebody wrote my name on here. If you really want to see Mary, you should just die. Okay, you fucker. Who wrote that? Put you... My... Oh, but you might be leading to a different place. 
than Mary, James. But you might be heading to a different place. Uh, what are you trying to say? Is James like going to hell? Is James like a, secretly a bad guy? He's done some bad things. Is that all I needed to come here for? Was to just see that stupid ass message? Oh shit. Oh, I didn't know we could just click on it. It would. It's fucked up. Oh, can't get over there. James can't hop over anything. He's very. He's really non athletic. So, man, hopping over something is just ridiculous. There's no way he could do that. Nothing. I don't know what this was for. Just a big waste of time. Maybe I should reread the reread the memo. I'm actually playing this particular set of videos in the daytime. The day, which is taking a bit of the scary edge off of this. I know that's probably not a good thing to do, play these games during the day, but hey. It's the only time I got to do it right now, so here we are. Well, I had a lot of files. I had no idea I had so many files. Or is it just like looping around? There's no way I have this many. It must be just looping around. Which is not good, because I want to find the one that I found in the motorhome, and I don't think I'll be able to find that. Yeah, oh well. I was going to reread it again, and maybe it would all make sense why I went there. But, uh... Guess that's not gonna happen. Woodside apartment. Let's just let's just go and get the letter wrench. Whatever the fuck that means. Make it sound like it's one thing. It's it's, it's a letter and a wrench all in one. Settle down. Uh, yeah, for the remainder of this, I'm just gonna avoid enemies as best I can. You know, save my bullets for Pyramid Head. We owe him for what he did to Maria. We owe him big time. It's blocked off. Okay, good. That's not where we want to go, though. But watch this end be blocked off, too. We need to go a little bit more further to get to our destination. But after the next block, when we get to the next intersection right here, I bet you it's blocked off. Bet you it's blocked off. All right, it's not blocked off. All right. Good thing I didn't bet you guys. But, where is it? Where is our destination? Let's check them out one more time. <sighs> it's Gonzalez Mexican Restaurant. Maybe I have to get in here around back. You know, we don't want to make things too easy for me. And it's not even circled in red. It's like got black. It's done with black ink. What the fuck? The hell? You know, you're bleeding, buddy? All over the place. Okay, we're not getting in there. <sighs> can we go through one of these houses? No, we cannot. Shit, I can't even see where way James is facing anymore. Oh, there's emphasis on this area right here. The camera was focused on this part right here. Or perhaps you are a fool. Oh, I've heard that before. The truth usually betrays people. A part of that abyss is in the old society. The key to the society is in the park, at the foot of the praying woman, inside of the ground, inside of a box. Ugh. To open it, I need a wrench. My patient buried it there. I knew, but did nothing. It made me uneasy to have such a thing near. I wasn't looking for the truth. I was looking for tranquility. I also thought that thing. Ugh. Fuck. I fled, but the museum was sealed as well. Now, no one dares to approach that place. If you still do not wish to stop James- Ah, oh, what the fuck? I pray to the Lord to have mercy on your eternal soul. Man, somebody is just 
messing around with us. They know us. They know we're coming. They know our business. Oh, what the fuck? Was that it? I didn't even read what it was. It's the wrench. Turning nuts and bolts? Oh, so, ah, okay. So, I thought it was in the Mexican restaurant, but it was just on someone's stoop. The letter in the wrench. <sighs> it's gonna be hard to find that fucking letter again, but I wanna see it again. Okay. Ah, oh, here we go. <sighs> no, this isn't the one. Oh. Uh... This is the one. The key is in the park. This is the one I... Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We read it again. <laughs> Old society. The key to the society is in the park. At the foot of the praying woman inside the ground. So it's buried underground in a box. I don't know what they mean by a praying woman. But we did go to a park earlier when we first met Maria. But I don't know how the hell I'm going to get back there. To open it, I need a wrench. My patient buried it there. I knew, but it did nothing. I saw the thing. I fled the museum. was, But the museum was sealed as well. Now no one dares to approach that place. Uh, someone's just, well, wants us to stop. So, okay, we have to make our way somehow. I have no idea. It's dark as fuck. I don't even know where I am anymore. Uh. Rosewater Park. So I gotta make my way up to Rosewater Park. So, <laughs> it doesn't even look like I can get there. I gotta go to the Woodside Apartments again? So I have been over here. Maybe I gotta run back from where I came. But still, I couldn't get up there through anywhere around here. Maybe if I do run all that down Wilts Road, it'll connect me to Nathan Street, and I can run all the way up Nathan Street to Rosewater Park. It's got to check on it, so. God, I don't want to do all that running. Who knows what kind of horrors I'll face on the way. Not to mention, I'll most definitely get lost. That door just looked like it could be entered. Big time. The fuck was that? Mannequins all over the place. Oh, this that that gate looked like it could be gone through. That's one thing, you can never really tell if something can be entered or not. Okay, let's see how far I've gone. Oh, it's blocked off. Everything's blocked off over here. Watch this. Yep, I don't know how I'm going to get there. No clue. Yeah, maybe I got to cut through the apartments again. The last thing I want to do is have to cut through those damn apartments again. Revisit that nightmare. Shut up. At least I'm getting items. I might be running around aimlessly, but at least I'm putting myself in a good position. Of course not. What makes you think you'd be able to go in there? Uh! James is looking at something again. I didn't pick this up? What the hell? Shotgun shells. And my shotgun should be really packed to the brim with ammo by this point. At least that's what it feels like. I feel like I've been collecting a lot of bullets for that thing. Alright! Let the bullshit begin. Let's see if I can... Maybe Martin Street will let me cut through to get to Nathan Ave. Let's see what we can do here. I 
it's so quiet now. Even more unsettling. I'd rather hear my radio going and those creatures walking around in complete and utter silence. Well, there's a lot of enemies around here. I'd be so dumb to sit here and try to fight any of them. Oh, man. Oh, what's this? Hold on, hold on. Hold the phone. No, no, still good. See if Martin Street checks out. Does it check out? Oh, it's blocked. Ah, oh, big fat fuck you. Big fat fuck you. Yeah. Wholeheartedly. Fuck! Almost got smacked in the face by a mannequin leg. By half a mannequin leg. Almost got the shit slapped out of me. So. I guess I gotta go through Woodside Apartments. Fuck! Ugh, get smacked first. I can't believe these things are even managing to hit me at all. Even if I screw up for a second, they still. They move so slow, they shouldn't be able to catch me like that. It's ridiculous. Apartments. Fuck. Can't get there no more. What? I don't know how to get to this place. This is, this is annoying. Oh shit. The door that wakes in darkness open. Darkness opening into nightmares. What? Oh shit. Mm mm. Oh, it's taking a long time to load. There's gonna be all kind of crazy shit. Or nothing. Is this, is this... Did this just bring me back to where I've been before? Maybe just on the other side of shit now I can get to stuff now? Yeah, 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 yeah. It just put me in on the other side. So I went in through Salt Street and it brought me back out to where I was already at. But on the other side of the fences and the barricades or whatever the stupid shit that was blocking me. Let's see what's down here first. Any ammo, any health. How about a save point? I'm running out of time. There's plenty of enemies. Plenty of enemies for me to chew through. Plenty of fucking enemies for me to chew through. Plenty of enemies for me to chew through. Maybe this is supposed to come to a dead end, right? Cat's Street. Let's just see what's over here. Nothing. No health, no nothing. Uh, it was worth it. We found some health. That's all. We could use all the first aid kits we can get, man. Now he's looking at something else. I could barely see that ampule. Oh shit! Get the first aid kit, James! Good thing that thing started to have a seizure and didn't proceed after me. Oh, oh. What the hell is that? Is that anything? It's just a part of the background. It looked like that was a letter or something. I got a letter. Oh man, I just cornered myself. Alright, so I guess we got all the atoms that could have been gotten down that street, down Cat's Street, or whatever the hell it's called. What's this? Oh shit. Oh, leads nowhere. I got excited. <laughs> Too bad there's not a lot of secret areas in here. If there are, I haven't found any. Ah, 
But yeah, that's gonna do it for this episode, guys. I am, I believe, very close or on my way to the park. Blue Creek. Yeah, we're almost there. So I'm just gonna cut it here. And when I get back, we will, we will be at the park. Trying to see what we can do with this wrench. Oh, and yeah. So if you like the video, feel free to like it. If you want more, feel free to subscribe. And I'll see you guys on the next episode of Let's Play Silent Hill 2 Blind. This is the Game Virus. Thanks for watching. Later. Thank you.